I'm out here this afternoon mixing up uh, uh, kelp and mixing salt. So uh, just mixing it up here in an old uh, mineral bucket. Uh, we've got some uh, organic kelp here that uh, I had on hand for a little bit and then uh, got some mixing salt and so we're just uh, mixing those together and preparing to take them out into the right into the field for uh, putting in the mineral feeder so this is what we feed them right now for minerals and uh, yeah this is what we're doing it's kind of cold this evening I've got a jacket on uh, we're having a cold snap here kind of odd for April uh, but it's supposed to get down like freezing tonight which is unusual um, so yeah uh, keep you updated here as I get this done all right we're all uh, all mixed up and got the salt and kelp mixed together this stuff smells like uh, smells like the ocean especially you add the salt with the kelp it smells a lot like the ocean but about to jump on the wheeler there and uh, haul this out I just moved the cows to another paddock and uh, I'm going to uh, move the mineral feeder into that paddock pour this into it and um, I'll be done for the evening so it's uh, quite cold uh, have to deal with all this wind and stuff traveling across there, but uh, we're going to get it done. Woo! Cold ride over here, but uh, we've got the mineral feeder right there. And a whole lot of uh, compadres waiting for uh, some minerals. So we're about to grab the sack off of here and pour it in. What do you guys think? Want some minerals? I think they do. Got a line at the mineral feeder. Only one head at a time can fit in there. So uh, you can see how they have it leaned back. That's why we have it in there where it can move around and everything. And uh, that way they can kind of rough it up and not, not tear it up. <laughs> 